Hmm? The snake skin, you can see the, yeah. the color of the snake. Wow. So you've processed yeah. it now. Yeah. Yeah. Can I touch it? You can touch it. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, it looks like real leather now. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. uh -huh. That leather I show you. The one that. All right, what's up everybody how you all doing today so we are still in Kano state and uh, right now we are going to check out how leathers are actually produced in Kano as many of you may know Kano state is the largest producers of leather all the leathers are used most of the leathers are used in Nigeria and outside of the country is actually produced in Kano state and in today's video I want to take you guys to see how these leathers are actually being produced right now we are deep inside your deep inside some of the ancient worlds in canon to check out how this thing has been done all right okay hope you learn a thing or two today it's going to be an interesting video and this is a uh, goat skin okay this is goat skin yes. this very one yes okay when we go to this company to buy this they use the uh, original one okay number one number two number three okay so this is the number three yeah. okay. and you don't have to use it so we people will go there and buy it. Just like hundred pieces or more than that. Mm -hmm. Almost one we just come to. So we buy it we come here. So you buy this goat skin? Yes. Do you buy it dried like this? Yes, like this. Back. You buy it dried like this. Yes. Okay. So we use that. Okay. This so this is a pit. Yes. You put a uh, good water. You put water. Yes. Okay. You put it inside. Okay, so you put this yes. inside. Inside. Mm -hmm. We put it and tomorrow early in the morning mm. we come and take it away. Okay. And it is dry. When it dry, we come to another again. Okay, so let me understand. When you are buying this goat meat, eh, mm -hmm. does it come dry like this? Yes. You come you buy it dry like so they've already dried it up. You buy it dry like this. Look at it. The number three, yes. the way it is. Yes. Okay, this is goat goat skin now. This is goat skin. Okay. There is goat skin and there is sheep skin. Okay. Okay, so this is goat. Yes, we can yeah. Okay. Put another put water. Put another water here. And put the chemical. Okay. Like potash. Potash, okay. Sodium sulfide mm -hmm. and the carbide. Okay. We mix them all so that we can put it. Put it inside. Okay. For one day you leave it for one day yeah, yeah, for two days okay or two days yes. okay one day or two days one day or it two days and how the 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 goat skin, sheep skin, snake skin, and all kinds of animal skin. That dried one I told you. Yes. The chemical that we put there. Mm. Okay. So that when it, uh, when it reached tomorrow, it will uh, all the, um, the head of the head of the skin. Mm. Uh -huh. mm. Okay, remove. so all the hair will remove. Yeah. Yes, so it will just be that skin mm -hmm. the way it is now. So we create another Good water, few water. Okay. We put it inside. There is sufficient sheet we use. Okay. So that we can put it, if we put it, we can see. Okay. Mm -hmm. You see, this is a pigeon sheet. Okay. Okay. Ah. Which which skin is this one? This one is snake skin. Okay, this one is snake skin. Yes. Unbelievable. Also, we use the same place. Mm -hmm. We use the skin and use the uh, snake skin. We put it inside the pigeon sheet. Mm. Uh, we see to be smooth. Okay. Look at it. See. Okay. Very so smooth. Also, this is why it will take one day. Mm. Tomorrow, it will come out. So after it, he uh, bring it out like this. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you put it here. Put it back. Yes. Okay. So after mm -hmm. tomorrow, if you bring it there, we can just bring it here. Mm -hmm. so like put another water. Okay. We wash it inside this other piece. Yeah, there is a chemical mm -hmm. which is called acacia. Acacia chemical. Yes. Okay. We use it to be white, so it will be like that. You see it? Mm. There is no any hair. 
the ones that I show you, mm. um, that ghost skin. Mm. He has, has hair. Now. But yes, now yeah. the ghost skin turns yeah. like this like and has no single hair. Yes, we put chemical. Okay. So that here it will take two days. Mm. If we put it today, go tomorrow, mm. there is a people who are going to move this meat. Okay. So if they remove it, we can bring, they can bring it another uh, again. Okay. So that we can put another cassia. Put it salt. Put salt and then put it again? How, uh, how can look at it, how we put it. Okay, so you wash it, put salt and, and, and then you dry it. And dry it so that we finish. Mm. There is a people who come to sell to buy it. Yes, they make color just like this one to your back. This color. They make color. they need it white. Like this, this one, one. They can okay. Buy that they want it white like this, they buy. Yes, if they don't want white, they want color, they will take it. Take it. Yes. So, how do you make this colored one? Yes, there is a people here that are they, they here. Yes. Can we see? Mm -hmm. Can you show us a little bit? Can we? Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 The one that before we put okay. it inside the chemical, mm. it is now like this one. Ah. We use the chemical and then we can wash it. So okay. that if we buy it 10 or 20, Baba or Salo? Thousand, Salo. you can bring it to him so that he can make it. Make the color. Any type of color you need so that he can make it. I see some red ones there too. Yes. Okay. Ah. Salo, sir. Exactly. So this is snake skin. Snake skin yes. Oh boy. Okay. This is snake skin. You can see the, yeah. the color of the snake. Wow. So you've processed yeah. it now. Yeah. Mm. Okay. So what is it? What is it trying to do now? It's just to make it very short. Okay. That's what he's doing. Yeah. Like this. Wow. You see the difference. You see? Okay. That is the difference. this one. Oh, this is very soft now. Ah. So that, so that you can make wallet, belt. Okay, can you use those to make belts, yeah, wallet? Yes. So, but how do you now remove this color of the skin? Just put it inside that chemical. Chemical. Mm, then it will go out. Then it will go out. Oh. So that the color will become like this, and put another acacia. So that acacia. That is how we. Use. Wow. <laughs> you see? Technology well, is you're wow. any help for government, that is the problem. Uh -huh. Also skin that we can take it to uh, 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 overseas. Okay. Like Spain, India uh -huh. and America. Okay. Also. They are buying the supply it to them. Supply it to them. Okay, you put supply to yes, them. Yeah. Supply it to them. There so do they have their contact one, persons here? Uh, yes, there is one person here who buy it. Mm -hmm. like the one way he buy it, he just send it to them. Okay, but so what I want to find out then, because mm -hmm. people watching this video, people may be interested yeah. to buy. Maybe. My, yeah, my own yeah. contact they may be interested okay. to buy. Yeah. So do you have enough to sell, yes, even if you want to buy it? We have it. You have? They say that they have it. So when you we want it, like it's a thousand or more than that. More than that. You have it. You have. Yes. You when you can you supply it, that. Yes. Don't package it. This is a red one. Yeah. Ah, yeah. I see. Sheep skin, there is a goat skin. Yes. But once it's yeah, produced it's like this, you cannot know the difference between sheep skin, goat skin. No, we know the difference. You, you know. Yes, no, me, I know. Okay. If I show you that this one, uh, sheep skin. Also, there is uh, also this one sheep skin. Okay, sheep skin. Uh, you see this one is goat skin. Okay, this is goat yes. skin. Ah. Uh, see that it is too long, more than the sheep skin. Is there a length of this? No length. No, no. Uh, there's length. There's length. Yeah, there's length. That's why you say this one is too long. Sheep skin is very big one. Okay, it's very big. But if I didn't hear you say cow skin, no cow skin here. Yes. There's cow skin. There's cow skin yeah. too. Am I in the neighborhood? They never bring it. They never, they never bring it. Here. Okay, so I have just one last question for you. People that sow shoe, mm. like the base in East Aba, mm. do they, where do, do they come here to buy? They come here to buy. Which one did they buy? Like this one? Small, yes, this okay, small, small. small. Yeah, small, small. Mm. But there is a Chinese leather. There's what? Chinese, Chinese leather. leather. Yes. Okay. So that is why this one they never buy it. 
Oh, because this one is, is more expensive. More than 10 years or oh, 12 years. Our people come here plenty and buy this. Okay. By the time Chinese, Chinese leather come. Yes, leather come so that they stop. They stop. So they Chinese leather is cheaper? Yes, it's cheaper more than this one. Oh, I see. This one, one, but ma this one. This one is the correct one. This, this one is the stronger. Yeah, it's stronger. Ah, it's better than the Chinese leather. This okay. One. okay. So that is different. Yeah. Mm, I see. But also, still there are some people who come here and buy it so that they make Kampala and take it to the our. Yeah. Can you show me the sample of the one that you send out? Is it this one that we we'll send that is dry? Yeah, the that, okay. That's the one you send out. Mm. I hope you guys are seeing how this leather is being produced locally. This is incredible. So for those of you that who might be interested to invest in this business, please reach out to me. You're just gonna get your contact, alright? You reach out to me if you're interested to invest in this business. Most of the leather that is sold by Gucci and the rest of them, I actually got them from this place. So if you're interested in this business, just let me know. Ah, you are. Baba Sanu? Okay, so that you export. He's the one who exports it. Okay, he's the one that exports it. Okay. Bring their customer here. Okay. So he's the one who takes it to the customer. Okay. The customer buy it and take it away. Yeah. Okay. So this is just how it is you export. Okay, so whether it's a. Uh, well, there are different grades. So how do we know the grade that you're exporting for us? I assume you want to buy and export. Yes, they come out in a grade. Okay, so that it is three grade. Okay, three grade. Yes. Okay. Okay, so let's see the different grades now. This is number one. Okay, this is this is grade one. Grade one. Oh, ah. Okay. 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 This is the grade one letter. Yeah. Okay. You see okay. It's so it's a bit it's very different. Yeah. There's no any scratch. No scratch, this. okay. Yeah. It is French one. Okay. This is grade two. This is grade two. Yes. How do we know the difference? Yes. Okay, because of the uh, this is grade one. You see? Okay, it has some uh, punches there. Yeah. Okay, so the grade one is totally smooth. Yes. Ah. Yeah, okay. So what's the cost? What, what we want? Let's say want to let's say want to buy like let's say ten ten sample. Ten ten. Grade one, grade two, grade three. Ten ten sample. Let's say one two three. Uh, just ten ten pieces. What to be the cost? So that if they if they look at it and it's something that is okay for them, they cannot buy it plenty. You understand? Yeah. Because it's business now, you have to do sampling first. Mm. Okay, grade one. Two five for one. Okay. Number two. One eight. One eight. One eight. One eight. Grade three. Okay. It's one four. One four. But it's very cheap. Wow. I was surprised they had to. You see? <laughs> wow, that's, it's very cheap. Nigeria ranks among the highest quality of leather found globally. This is because the leather comes from a free roaming animal such as cattle, sheep, cow, which makes their hind and skin durable to produce high quality leather goods. Nigeria leather is exported internationally with Nigeria making around 600 to 800 million annually from leather export. It is projected that the Nigerian leather industry will generate over $1 billion by 2025. Majority of the leather export come from local tanneries like this and also bigger mechanized tanneries in Kano. Due to the importation of lesser and cheaper leather products from China, most of the leather product producers in Nigeria prefer to use China leathers. I hope that in the near future, there will be some kind of holistic synergy to strengthen the whole production chain of leather products in Nigeria, where the man in Kano can easily sell his leather to the man in Aba to produce quality shoe, bag and the likes for global exports. 
All right, so this is how leather is being produced locally in this part of the world that like I've just shown you guys. All right, so for those of you who may be interested to also buy and have it overseas, it can be done. I have their contacts. You can just reach out to me and I will send their numbers to you. All right, so that's how it's done. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, comment below, share it, and subscribe for more videos like this.